Hey, what's up everyone? Eric Ross with the guy with the eye here to give you a quick tip on how to shoot through fences. What do I mean? Let's check it out. So in the world, there are a lot of mothers, fathers, brothers, daughters, cousins, etc. There's family. And with family, you know, a lot of places, you know, you might be in a good location, but there might be like a fence in the way of a great landscape, of great scenery, or if you're at your like brothers, your sons or anything like a video a sports game or something like that normally if they're the field there's going to be a fence in front of it for protection but how do you shoot through that well, i'm going to give you basically the easiest tips on doing that and essentially it comes down to just two things that's the distance to the fence and i'll show you examples right here essentially live unedited raw uh, i'll shoot them right here and you're focusing so your distance to the fence and you're focusing Autofocus is going to let you down most of the time because it's going to try and grab the chain links to the fence. It's going to try and grab these shapes, patterns, and the light that comes off of it. So getting manual uh, uh, focus is key here and getting close so that way it kind of just disappears. So let me show you really quickly. I'm going to essentially be using an F4 just to get a little bit of a landscape here. So an F4, low ISO because it's very bright out. But just look at these and just look at what I mean. I'll start out even uh, kind of going uh, using autofocus and you'll see that you'll see that the remains of the fence here first and then I'll manually dial it in a little bit at a time and let's go from here so let's let's really check it out so essentially all I'm doing is just I'll go back a little further so if I'm back here you'll see that you know obviously it's going to get the fence in focus but what if I get up really close and what if I manually dial it in so let's essentially put my lens almost right up to here you know with this lens I can kind of shoot through it almost but most other lenses, DSLR lenses and everything like that cannot. So let's just really look at it. So I'll go from here, let's get really close. Take a shot, you might see it's still a little bit of the, of the shapes and everything like that. But how about if you dial it in, you're close, and you get shots like that. So it's just simple stuff. Distance from the fence, I guess mind your aperture a little bit, but manually focus, and that's one of the easiest tips to do for a hard thing that you might not understand. That's how you shoot through fences. Everyone, keep an eye out.